Hello everybody. Hey, I got a my pillow mattress cover for a RV queen and we're going to throw that on there today. I've got a memory foam mattress in here now. It's a uh, RV queen. The memory is too good. When I lay down on it, it's a little firm. When I lay down on it, I make a divot and I need, if I want to turn over, I need to throw a grappling hook and rope to the other side of the bed to turn over. If I stay in the new place long enough, I'll make a new divot. I'm going to put the my pillow mattress topper on here and see if it doesn't make this. The, the mattress that we have is fine, except that it's the memory is too good. So when we're off of it for a period of time, it levels itself back out. I'm going to put the my pillow topper on it and see if we can't make it more livable, uh, more pliable to sleep on at night without settling into a large divot. I haven't even taken this out of the box yet, so we will do that now. And I did get, they had some kind of little special on, and it came with two pillows, I believe. Yes, it did. To my pillows. As a uh, saying from Psalms nine nine. If you use a knife, don't cut the mattress. That's not in the instructions, but I'm pretty sure I'm right. It looks nice and thick. Okay. And it's got uh, some straps so that you can strap it over your other mattress. It's one thing, and anybody that's got an RV knows this, it's with these cabinets in here it's difficult to make these beds up and what we found is probably the easiest way is to pull this back as far as you can so that you don't have to climb to the top of the mattress and it's easier if you do this as a team But my photographer is the other half of my team. And she's busy. I checked her appointment book. I'm sure she's busy right now. <laughs> the mattress we have is from the Denver Mattress Company. And it's a good mattress. I just... I don't know and my wife doesn't have any issues with it but I guess I weigh enough when I lay in it 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 just makes this wonderful divot it's very comfortable until I try to turn over so yeah and we switched mattress over and everything thinking that it was the mattress yeah we flipped it uh, end to end and we flipped it over and it's exactly the same thing. And it, right now, it's just as flat as a fritter. It's perfect. But when I lay in it, I get a divot. If I lay on her side, I get a divot. So it's just, I'm just old and fat. And I just settle into the mattress too deep. It has too much memory for me. So, oh, this feels good. Take my shoes off. Oh, this is going to be great. Yep. 
And I think what this is going to do probably more than anything, it's going to distribute my weight a little bit so that I don't sink as deeply into the other mattress. That's just a theory that's in my head. I don't know if it's going to work or not. If it doesn't work, I'll make another follow-up video on this. And if anybody has any questions, just throw them in the comments. And we'll get the pillows and stuff in here. We're going to be taking a trip in a few weeks, three weeks, something like that. And I'll uh, I'll do a follow-up on this in three weeks. We'll put get everything made back up and I'll um, sleep on it and we'll see how it works out. So I appreciate anybody that uh, takes a look at this. If you have any questions, throw them in the comments. I'll get to them as quick as I can and uh, do whatever follow-ups I need to do. So I've never had a my pillow before. So this will be a new experience in itself. Place pillow and dryer for 15 minutes before first use. So we've got three weeks to get this into the dryer for 15 minutes. Oh, that's good. I'm beating it against the microphone. <laughs> Okay, well, I'll throw these in the dryer for 15 minutes and let them fluff back up. And uh, we'll finish making up the bed and get about our trip and give you a follow-up report. We have the uh, pillows. We ran those through the dryer, like it said, and they fluffed up real nice. We are about to go on a trip. So uh, whenever I get a chance to sleep on all of this stuff and test it out, I'll do an update. I really appreciate everybody watching. If you have any questions, throw them in the comments and I'll get to them as quick as I can. Take care. If you're interested in following up on this, subscribe and we'll get back to you in a couple of weeks.